Hey guys! Do you suffer from food allergies such as dairy or gluten? In this video, we are going to show you where you can eat, what you will eat and how to prepare to make it all happen. We're here at Captain Jack's restaurant and we are here because we wanted to know if they have a special menu for when you have allergies. And the good news is they have. Ask at the desk where at your restaurant if they have uh, a folder like this. And now we're very curious what the menu looks like, so let's have a look. This menu has been specially prepared for over 16 different kinds of allergies. We'll name them for you. Peanuts, celery, shellfish, fenugreek, gluten, milk, lupin, mollusks, mustard, nuts, egg, yellow pea, fish, sesame, soy and sulfites. All table service, buffet and counter service restaurants use this same menu. Unfortunately, not every restaurant has got a different menu for you. So, for example, what does Captain Jack's got to offer for dinner? As a starter you have tomatoes and corn or a Mediterranean soup. As a main course you can have sautéed chicken, fusilli with uh, white sauce, and beef cottage pie with carrot mash or a chicken quinoa. Uh, as a dessert you can have caramelized apples, apple delight or a fruit salad with mint. This is what your dish will look like. It's a sample but... Oh and, and look they, they even tried to put the Mickey shape in there to keep it cute you know. <laughs> so if you have an allergy and the rest of your company doesn't you still can come with them to a Disney restaurant. Now, what about your breakfast? If you need a special menu because of your allergies, you have to let the manager know that you need them because the items are not on a regular breakfast available. So they have to get it specially for you. So our advice is that when you book your uh, hotel or when you check in your hotel, you immediately, immediately let the people at the reception know that you have an allergy and that you want to book the breakfast but that you need to have a special menu there. Want to be a superhero? Subscribe to our channel! Yes, Café de la Brousseille is open so we're going to get our favorite falafel... falafel... Oh, why don't I ever know the name of those things? Uh, yeah. So we're going to get our favorite falafel sandwich! Yay! I'm already started. <laughs> it's so good! It's so good! I couldn't wait! Yeah, something like this. It won't focus, but uh, but it's delicious. There's lettuce in it and some some uh, sort 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 of a sour cream kind of dressing, and of course falafel. Really good. Are you a vegetarian? Looking for a vegetarian dish? Why not going to Café de Cascadeur? They've got a vegetarian burger for twelve ninety nine, and I can tell you it's not the same burger that you get. Uh, in the normal counter server restaurant. This one is a different from taste, maybe because it's made with love. Okay, now let's take a look at a counter service restaurant such as Casey's Corner. What happens when we ask for the allergy menu? I've just asked for the special menu uh, for when you have an allergy and she's going to get it for us so we can have a look what's on there. According to the regular brochure, you should be able to get the special allergy menu at any counter service restaurant in Disneyland Paris. But instead, we got yet another option. An allergy list of all the regular sold items at Casey's Corner. And it's very clear which allergies are in which meal. So let's have a look. In the giant classic hot dog, there are gluten. And there are milk products. And there are milk products as well. And nothing there left so let's see if you have a gluten intolerance you can get fries yogurt something you can have ice cream and drinks we just saw the menu for when you have allergies here at Casey's Corner I'm not really enthusiastic about it what do yeah. you think well uh, it's the basic stuff and it only gives you an uh, update of what's in there. On the list it was their normal menu yeah. and what you can have and what you cannot have. So I'm not really enthusiastic about it. And I'm not really sure about uh, cross-contamination. It doesn't seem that uh, if for instance you are uh, 
gluten intolerant and uh, and also milk intolerant they just think okay i can take this option and that it's cross mix in the kitchen so i think they there could be a little bit more for when you uh when you want to buy something here at the counter service i'm very curious what the table service and buffets have yeah. We are here at a restaurant des stars and I would like to show you guys what you can have. So this is the booklet that I got. It's all in French by the way. So they cover a lot of things. These are all the desserts, banana bread. Mm. This here is the salad bar. Chicken wings aren't gluten free. This one is gluten free. And this one isn't. And this one is. The ham is gluten free. These vegetables are not gluten free. I miss also some items here on this list because it said that the ratatouille is gluten free but I don't see any ratatouille here on the buffet vegetarian vegetable quiche I've never had that before pretty good not suitable for when you have a milk allergy what you can have is also the ham the noodles you can have also the bok de boeuf and you can also have the sautéed chicken. The time that we were in this land Paris and we asked for the special menu, we got this list. And nobody ever said to us, hey, we also have a special menu with a special starter, main course and dessert. Maybe that's an option for you. However, we never asked specifically for the manager and in the brochure it says you have to ask for the manager and ask for the special menu now that i have your attention subscribe to our channel the vegetarian burger we already digged in we are in Disney studios in a big restaurant mm -hmm. what's the name the name the is and i can tell you it tastes very good and that's because they make it fresh. They don't have it on stock like uh, they used to at uh, McDonald's. They make 20 hamburgers and keep them warm. These are made fresh to order. So nice and warm, hot. Burger, fries, ice cream and drinks are 10 euros in total. Mm. Yeah. And we've got some mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks and that's 3 euros extra. A uh, portion of four. If you have a gluten allergy, why not try out Planet Hollywood? They have a special menu, gluten free menu, and uh, we're gonna check it out. Hollywood has got a big variety of all kinds of dishes. So mostly it's American food, but you can get all kinds of dishes. Three pages worth of gluten-free dishes. We're here at the next diner. And on the menu it states that they cannot guarantee cross-contamination with uh, allergens uh, like gluten. They also don't have a special uh, uh, gluten-free or lactose-free menu. If you're a vegetarian and you're looking for a vegetarian dish, here at Annette's Diner they sell the soya burger and this is what it looks like. Is this a vegetarian burger? It looks so meaty. It's really strange. We asked somebody here, a waiter, and he told us that it is in fact a soya burger, but it's been colored with beetroot. 
so that's why it's red so we can eat it uh, it's vegetarian so we're fine very curious about this burger because I have many vegetarian burgers here in Disneyland Paris I cannot remember I had this one ever in my life so let's try it the vegetarian hamburger I thought that it was really good I thought it was the best vegetarian hamburger I had in my entire <laughs> Disney experience? Yes, <laughs> ever. So, yes, absolutely a big number one, but the price... Uh, it's a bit steep. Uh, $18.99 yes. from the top of my head, with, but you got fries and coleslaw with it. This is a very nice um, thing to have, just uh, to treat yourself on something yeah. maybe expensive but delicious. This concludes our episodes for special diet needs dishes here in Disneyland Paris. We truly hope that this video will help you out when you are planning your Disneyland vacation. If it did, please leave a thumbs up at this video, we highly appreciate it. Also, when you have experiences with uh, special dishes here in Disneyland Paris, please leave it in the comments down below so you can help our other viewers who might have questions about it. And maybe next time, we'll, we'll see, see you in Main Street. Street. Bye! <laughs>